there is one issue with the baby. What's wrong with him? Hey. Oh, you guys have a YouTube channel, right? Yes. <laughs> I remember you. He was got a good size head there. What's he the head measuring out? It was like 33 leaks. Oh, wow. Nothing really. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well. You cannot be bothered right now. For a baby that moves all day, every day, he moves so much more than I and Jet ever did. He would not move at all. <laughs> so I mean, she got everything she needed, but she couldn't get like any face shots or anything. I was hoping for some good 3D, but Ooh, we're getting big, <laughs> getting so, so, so pregnant. It sucks that Trey can't be here and the kids. And I know a lot of hospitals like other places are letting you do that now, but not here. They're being super cautious, which is good. Hey. Hi. How are you? Good to see you today. I'm oh, glad I got to. <laughs> I uh, have my like, camera set up. I'm vlogging. Oh, 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 you want? <laughs> do you want me to put it over here? Are you okay with that? <laughs> no, I'm so proud you know me. my family and how we've got to get that content out. <laughs> yeah, you are a content family. That's for sure. So your baby looks good. Does this go right on your blog or do you edit it? <laughs> I, I edit plenty. You can okay. say whatever. <laughs> okay, yeah. Do you have it back yet of what baby is measuring then? Yep. Measuring. It doesn't seem like it's behind. Definitely not behind. <laughs> and with the way the cord inserts on the placenta, it's kind of on the edge of the placenta. Right. And that the biggest issue there is just is the baby growing well? Yeah. And baby's going fine. Plenty. Yeah. Okay, cool. Will I do another ultrasound then to check them out? Or? You probably don't need another one as right. long as when I put the right numbers in, we'll see what they what they look like they come out. Right. But we probably won't need another one unless you're measuring small or big or right. if you're you know if there's something else. Well, or um what did she say? Because he's still breached right now, will he yeah. check for that? We we definitely will do so when I said that we won't need another ultrasound, what I'm talking about is like a full ultrasound right. like this. I have a little handheld thing that I'll pull in, I'll bring into the office next time you're here. Just to see. And then the time down. after, because if you're next time, <clears throat> it, there, you've got about an 85-ish percent chance that baby's gonna turn on its own. Mm -hmm. But if not, when you hit 36 weeks, we'll try to turn the baby. Right. And so, and we do that in the hospital. Okay. Gotcha. Or okay. yeah, we did that possibly. So we'll check again at thirty six or check will I come in, in we'll two check, weeks? Yeah, I we'll, will I come in? So you don't need to do two weeks, you can do virtual visit in two weeks. Okay. Remind me when you have you been induced? Uh, with, with both, with yeah. Both. So there's not much uh, threat that you're gonna labor a lot early. Uh both times I went in to my induction not even dilated to a one yet. <laughs> Zero like nothing happening. So if it's anything like that I'm probably not gonna go early so if baby's still breached on the 11th mm -hmm. i'll put you on on the 16th okay but we don't do the version out here so okay we just put it there. Okay. The, the reason is because if there was if baby didn't tolerate it and right. the heart rate went down and we had to be ready to quickly deliver. we have to be ready yeah. and that would be by c-section right it's really unlikely cool okay so and the success rate is about 70 ish percent okay. of being able to change a baby gotcha from from breach to head down okay right. Also, hopefully he just flips before yeah. then. Yeah, and that he's, he's got like an 85, 90% chance he'll do that anyway. Okay, cool. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you. All right, Marla. Yep. Have, Have a good, good day. Home. Tell your family hi. Okay, hey, see ya. Bye-bye. Let's go. All right, so I'm going to show you guys the pictures that I got of this baby boy. <laughs> She's like, you can take kidney, I got kidney, spine, all the good stuff. He would not move at all, which is crazy because he literally moves so much more than Naya or Jet ever did. He's moving constantly. But we were pushing all on him and he was just not budging. So his face was, fa he's facing my back. So nothing she could do. Could not get any face shots and I was really hoping for some cute 3Ds. But nope, apparently not. So as you guys heard me kind of talking to my doctor, baby is breech. And my other two were turned well before now. I'm 32 weeks tomorrow. So it's kind of unfortunate. I mean, most likely he still will turn is what they say. So hopefully that happens because I really don't want to have to have them manually try to turn him and things like that. So fingers crossed. Send me all the, what vibes would that be? All the 
spinning baby vibes. All the spinning baby dust, anti-breach dust. Baby no name, still don't have a name. Still gotta narrow that down and figure that out. <laughs> Cause right now, not, I, I don't know. I still just, nothing's speaking to me. <sighs> Anyways, okay, well, I'm gonna go drive home now to Trey and the kids. Maybe stop and get me a drink, I really want to, but Trey will make me feel guilty about it. <laughs> because I spend too much money getting drinks. He's restricted me to once a week, which is, is good. Yeah, he probably should have, should have less. So I've been doing one, one soda a week. So I went and got my last drink. You guys, I guess, saw in my last vlog. You're like, what are you talking about? Well, you literally just went and got one. Because my last vlog, I did go get one. But that was last Friday, and now it's Friday again. But the kicker is a couple days ago we went to our friend's soda shop and supported them. So that was my extra one during the week. So do I get back on my schedule? It's Friday again? I get to have another one? Yes. And I will finish it before I get home so Trey will never know. He will never watch this vlog so he will just not know. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I didn't finish it in the car. I'm not scared of him. I'm not scared. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hi. What? I got toys. You do got toys. That's so cool. Wow. Hi, guys. Oh, you guys are reading books? Yeah. And octopus is truly amazing. Hi. What's up? Should we talk about baby? Uh, sure, because I can't go to no appointments. You sure can't. Are you okay? Are you exhausted? I'm uh, so tired. Do you want to hear about the baby? Uh huh. So, no, so they did an ultrasound today to see if the baby was measuring behind, like if he, if he was too small because of the cord issue. So, what's your guys' guesses? Was the baby measuring small, regular, or big? Uh, regular. Big. Naya's right! The baby was measuring he's big. A, he's a thick boy. I don't like that at all. <laughs> he's big boy. Say, he's a thick boy. He's big boy. <laughs> mm, don't like that one bit. Okay. They really said he was Not really, big. but everything really was measuring. About on time. I mean, uh, on mark. Ahead of what I am. So I'm 31 six weeks today. Right. His head was measuring 34.3. That guy has a big ass <laughs> Well, all our kids really did. And then I said, well, I guess Jet and Naya both. Naya, your ultrasounds, when I was, when you were in my belly, your head was always measuring always two, two weeks, weeks ahead of the rest head. of your body. Big ass head. <laughs> Look at that <laughs> smile. <laughs> you got a big head? You got a big head? Which is not from you, because my head's bigger than Trey. So that's weird, because... Are you crying right now? I just exhausted. So... The yeah, so there's thing. no issue with the cord because he is growing plenty. I mean, there, is, plenty. It, but the cord I mean, is not there hasn't been an issue of the cord not getting enough nutrients to him, clearly, because he's growing, he's growing fine. fine. All the percentiles are above average, so he's doing just fine. He's a thick boy. <laughs> Anyways, but there is one issue. What? What? There is one issue with the baby. What? What's wrong with him? Um, he's breech. Oh no, the, oh he, his, his head, head's his down. head is right here. No, his head's supposed oh, to be down, right? supposed to be down, so yeah. his head's up. And Jet and I were they, like, head down, thing? no, they were head down way before now. Like, usually, I looked it up, they I was? guess, usually, most babies are head down, like they go head down and stay head down around like 24 weeks on. Really? By like 28 week appointment, like basically all babies are, like most, that's when they, they've turned down and they stay down. So what? And Jet and I both were like that. So he is head up right now and I'm 32 weeks. So, so what does that mean? only 7% of babies are still head up right now at 32 weeks. Right. Um, but it's still a really good chance. <laughs> but it's still a really high chance that he will turn before 36 weeks. My thing is this weeks. though, like so, babies move so much in right, there, they, they, stay, just, they, they so they be moving, but their head they, don't move. But I mean, I think that that's a big move to go all the way from like head up here to all the way down that way. They don't ever yeah, like roll full like that. It's usually their head is, especially because he doesn't really have room anymore. You know, that's why they, they stay in that position. It's like normally they pick the position of head down in my pelvis, mm -hmm. and then they don't have a lot of room to make full twists like that. Right. 
so they stay down there. But it makes sense. I don't know why I hadn't thought of this because he moves like crazy, way the more than tongue. the other ones. But he moves all, I feel it all down low. Where with the so kids, lit, I'm right. way less stuffed up in my ribs this time. Right. Because that's where his head is, yeah. So I, I'm still like looking like carrying high and stuff. But the movements are low because his feet, feet are, down are down there. He's oh, always okay. kicking on my bladder instead of kicking so on my then, ribs. So then, so say come 36, 37, so, he, he, he is still. No one's at the door. Yes, oh. is. Hi. I have another ultrasound 30, at 36 weeks and four more weeks mm -hmm. to see if he's still breech. And if, if he, he is, is then, what? then they would have me go to the hospital at 37 weeks to try to So that means no St. No Louis then. You got to do all of that. Because we will leave for St. Louis at 36 weeks. So if you breach, yeah, not you if can't still go. Breach, yeah. So it seems like we got to go now. Because I don't think we're going to. I'm about to go to LA is what I remember. Oh, I forgot that was happening. We have an LA trip first. I have something exciting coming up that I'll be vlogging next week. Going to LA for something special. Stay tuned. Anyways, win. overall, baby is good. Besides, the boy the is. Breach. And the other kid, our other kids weren't like this. So I'm saying up. they reach in there and do that. How the hell no, they do like that? No, like it was on my stomach, and I, supposedly it hurts really well, bad. Well, it sounds like it's, yeah, it's supposedly crazy. like uh, yeah. When I've heard of people having them move like. Some people are just like, no, I'm not gonna do it. Like, let's just do a C-section because it hurts really. really bad. It hurts that bad. Because they, yeah, are like, Pushing they have to find it and grab that. They're like, they're through my stomach though, but like, they like put hands on each side of the head and like pull the baby around. Ouch. Yeah. So, so that always obviously makes the baby freak out a bit. 100%. But they gotta monitor yeah, if the baby, the heart rate comes up. With the core already being marginal and stuff, it's like it's going. Because the, the core is barely like hanging on, right? Or. Does more just mean like it's there, just it's not just in the center? Really close to the edge. Right, so that's what I'm saying. Like that ain't gonna mess it up where they snap it, rip, rip it no, off or not. I don't think so. Okay, now. That's a lawsuit. <laughs> Anyways. PNS times. Not PMS. PNS. PNS for today's vlog goes to. Goes to. Uh, I knew she forgot because it's time. been a while. The PNS for today's vlog goes to Chasey. 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 <laughs> Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for having the post notification turned on. We really appreciate that. Yep. And if you would like to be our the next, next post, post notification, notification. Shout, out. shout out, you must one subscribe, duh. Two hit the bell to turn on the post notification because the it's called post notification shout out. Three, you must comment down below on this video. This one right here, hashtag PNS. PNS. And then that's then we just gonna pick somebody. Yep. And that's how we do that. So if that's Daddy. what you want, that's what oh. you oh my gosh, why Daddy. would you just throw the okay, bye bye.